Hello guys, today we're going to talk about finger clubbing. Clubbing is the painless soft tissue swelling of the terminal phalanges and this swelling increases the convexity of the nail. So as you can appreciate in this picture, the nail is very convex and there is increase uh, in the soft tissue right? as they are swollen. In this picture also you can appreciate the clubbing of the nails. Let's learn the mnemonic about uh, the causes of the clubbing. The mnemonic is clubbing itself where C refers to congenital heart disease, cystic fibrosis, cirrhosis of liver and Crohn's disease, L is lung abscess, U refers to ulcerative colitis, B means brachial arteriovenous fistula, another B refers to bronchiectasis, I means infectious endocarditis and interstitial lung disease, N refers to neoplasia such as lung cancer, mesothelioma, fibroma, and G refers to Graves disease or thyrotoxicosis. Now to know about the stages of the clubbing, just remember the mnemonic fleets. Stage 1 is fluctuation. The soft tissue just below the nail bed, they get uh, softened out and they and the fluctuation of the nail bed occurs in stage two there is obliteration of the lobby bone angle so this angle is the lobby bone angle and in case of clubbing this angle becomes greater than 180 degree normally it should be less than 165 degree stage three there is increase in the convexity of the nail so the nail becomes more convex as there is increase in the anterior posterior diameter stage 4 means drumstick appearance so there is uh, increase in nail pulp okay so this nail pulp it increases and it appears like uh, bulbous appearance so just like the end of the bulbous end of the uh, drumstick so there is drumstick appearance in stage 4 and in stage 5 the nail appears shiny or glossy with longitudinal striations okay so there will be longitudinal striations in the nail like that and they will appear shiny and this stage is also known as hypertrophic osteoarthropathy as there is uh, increased uh, thickening of the periosteum of bones such as uh, radius ulna tibia and fibula so this much for today thank you